I am, whatever you say I am, if I wasn't, then why would I say, I am, welcome to new video, been a while since I've degraded myself, have at her, if I'm sure we could work something out was a person, lift up them bangs, so the real roast can start, barista who gives unsolicited life advice to customers, looks like you're here, to advertise your OF, but you're not even cool enough to do that, you rang, the face the landlord sees at his door, when the rent is past due. Your mortal enemy just chilling in the background. Was your last time being degraded, when you got that awful tattoo on your arm. Another attention starved girl online. Looks like your lips were welded on by a cheap muffler shop. Looks like you work as a receptionist in a failing paper company and seek father figure in your manager. A narcissist such as yourself has never intentionally degraded yourself so quit lying. You got that tat, for you, yet, you have to have it on display for everyone to see, all the time. Avocado toast is not a personality. Timmy, stop putting balloons up your shirt, you're going to stretch it out. She's giving all my exes have left me, because of my mental health. You are at the lowest weight you will ever be again. This is temporary, miss. Last time she got with someone, she accidentally poked an eye out. Or is cold over there, or are you just happy to share your personality? First time doing this, give it your all. Yikes. More filter than George Carlin on the Disney Channel. You look 20, 30 and a divorced 45 year old at the same time. Which photo filter are you using? Trying to get my ex back, after he left me for a younger woman. Smooth skin filter working so much over time you moved into a higher tax bracket. You can probably hear people typing their comments on this post. Who needs an alarm clock, when you can hear the sun rise? Even my cough machine has better filters. Every single photo is filtered. You look like, if Dumbo and a praying mantis had a baby. You look like the girl that parks her car on a lookout, and then puts on a backpack to take selfies, and pretend you're really into hiking. Actual legitimate question. When's the last time you took a picture without a filter? You look like you would do some crazy stuff for $20. Post again without such strong filters, so we can see how disappointing you really look. You probably hear better than the monsters in A Quiet Place. I'll dig my own grave you just have to put me in it. If a masculine lesbian and a twink had a baby, it imagine it would look something like you. Whatever your father did to you I'm sorry, for him. Why is this sub full of young girls in Nirvana shirts? If we reincarnated Cobain, he'd immediately go out shopping for another shotgun. Why your armpit so yellow? You look like you try to act like you are interesting, but you have less personality than a mannequin at Target. Some kinda biohazard culturing in your pits. If people keep trying to bury you, it's probably because of the smell. You look exactly like one of those hairless cats, with psoriasis. In the first pic you looked like a grungy kid from the 90s, in the second like a suburban mom who won the best hair contest at them all every year for 25 years, and I already forgot the third but yeah. Oh, so edgy, mom and dad must have loved you unconditionally and now you are oppressed, and fighting all the fights. Enough with the daddy issues, attention seeker and brain ill roasts. Give me something to really cry about. Ensure you're buried not cremated, and in a mysterious spot so when archaeologists finally dig you up in the future, you can continue to disappoint people. In the 1930s they used to just put people like you in institutions, so the rest of us didn't have to look at you. I don't know how you did it, but each photo has a distinct odor, and none of them are pleasant. Your pets are the only outlet for your affection. And even they look, like they'd rather be put to sleep. I honestly believe, that you asked for a minor tattoo, but the tattoo artist said yo screw that, we have to hide as much of this thing as possible. Your dog taught itself how to write, just so it could beg the police to save it. Whatever your dad did to you I'm sorry, for him. You look like you got poisoned, and have almost recovered. Going through each picture is like watching the downfall of a woman becoming an OF model or exotic dancer, reminds me of my mum. You're the type to say eat the rich, and then order DoorDash. 
one day, should you get married, you will disappoint some poor man's parents nearly as much as you've disappointed your own. If they ever cast for a live action inside out you have anxiety and sadness in the bag. Just turned 18, you know what that means. That your 42 year old boyfriend is now less nervous? My eyes are down here. You look like you got a built in mute button on your forehead. Your math, history and science teachers now don't run the risk of going to prison? That you already started your OF side thinking you would make millions of dollars off of your body, but then realize that no one actually wants to pay to see you naked, yep you can finally sign surgical consent, to remove that big mole on your forehead. Roast me, lesbian. The my brows about to enter the chrysalis phase and hatch into moths, not butterflies. Your therapist calls you financial security behind your back. If the carpet matches the drapes, I'd imagine the carpet resembles that of a used Brillo pad. On behalf of all straight men, we support you, and are totally okay with not trying to sleep with you. Every interaction with you must be awkward. How can a dude be a lesbian? IDK what sports team you cheer for, but the black paint is meant for your cheeks, not above your eyes. 36, and one week till my birthday, celebrating 9 months sober. Banned from all local fast food places with ball pits. I'm in my mid 40s and your face is the kind of confidence boost I needed today. I just turned 32, and you look about the same age as my dad. It's never too late to relapse. Congrats on being sober. Hopefully any women you hit on errant. I'm not roasting you. Well done on 9 months. Just gone 500 days here. One day at a time. Time to get back on the liquor bud. There's nothing about you worth being sober for. Man stare could pierce the ozone layer. I'm older than you. And you somehow look both younger and older than me at the same time. Dr. Phil minus the doctorate. Acclaim. Fame, money, likable personality, charisma, catch me outside girl. Congratulations on your sobriety. Well done. Commiserations on your appearance. Just stay indoors. French, 47, single, divorced, shy, tattooed, IT project manager, body. 5 feet 5, 170 pounds, 1 meter 65 centimeters, 77 kilograms. Why did bro put a whole description, like he's livestock or something? You could have just stopped at French. Wow, you do actually look like an IT project manager. I totally believe you're a 47 year old shy project manager who's a giant loser, that's believable. But you are not 170 pounds. Your ex-wife made the right choice. You're trying to bait people into making fun of your body or your language. But deep down in your heart you know, that it is your personality that drives people away from you. You didn't have to tell us you were single, we knew immediately. The one project he couldn't truly manage was marriage, sat, shy French music. You actually look like a fellow bro, that I wouldn't mind hanging out with, but that's because I'm a complete and utter loser. I could just see us going to some French pubs, and getting ignored by everyone. Roast me, I'm hosting my 20 year high school reunion. We'll use the best roasts in the show. I bet your favorite social media app is LinkedIn. I assume you're holding the reunion at least 500 yards from an actual public school? I wouldn't be surprised, if you have a collection of sandals. If you too was a person. You look like you'd ab your forehead with a napkin, when you have something seasoned with black pepper. Why do your teeth look like both the before? And after comparison of whitening strips. You eating a vanilla ice cream cone seems like cannibalism. I think I ran into you last week in the Whole Foods oatmeal aisle. Voted most likely to have the hardest working hairline in 20 years. You look like someone who needs a lot of liquid courage, before he can make love to his wife. That tracks. The unpopular nerd always comes out of nowhere, to appoint themselves as master of ceremonies. Must have felt just like prom. Your mom's still waking you up in the same bed, having no date, and your dad dropping you there. He definitely sits to pee. 18th birthday today, make it the worst. It's like if Hell's Angels sponsored Make-A-Wish. Looks like the worst already happened 18 years ago today. You look like you tell people you're a biker, and then pull up on a tricycle. 
You look like you discovered Metallica from Stranger Things. Your dad must have been a T-Rex. It's like a character from Bob's Burgers escaped into the real world. Need smaller head or bigger body. Thanks for watching, you grass-eating animals. See you soon. Bye.